everyone, welcome back to my channel. First of all, I apologize for the messy background. I needed a big area to do this, so we're in my living room. But today, we are here with the Playmobil City Life school set. So it's back to school time, which is really sad to say that summer is coming to an end. I go back to school in like 20 something days. It's so sad, um, but these Playmobil school sets are honestly so cool and I saw them in New York at the Toy Fair and oh my god you guys I was obsessed with them. They are so cool and I'm really excited to share them with you guys and thank you so much my friends at Playmobil for sending them to us. So yeah like I said it's back to school time so if you're going back to school your dolls can go back to school too. So we are gonna open these up and take a look at them and these are like three separate sets and they don't all need to go together but it's even cooler when they do because first we have the giant, the Playmobil furnished school building. This retails for $129.99 and it's available now. I think they're all available now. It says they're available in August, so they're available now. And so it says that classes are in session at the furnished school building. Upon arriving, students can uh, find, yeah, students can find storage for all their school supplies in the downstairs lockers, ooh, <laughs> before heading their first class of the day. Then with the help of the functioning digital clock, they sent me batteries and I was wondering what they're for. The digital clock works, that is so cool. Okay, <laughs> the functioning digital clock with school bell. And <laughs> students can make sure they get to class on time. Those unable to take the stairs can use the functioning elevator. Guys, this thing is so cool. There is a little girl with a wheelchair, so she's definitely for that elevator, that's so cool. <laughs> um, along with the access to ramp and larger bathroom stalls. Makes the school wheelchair friendly, so cool. The downstairs room is a fully equipped biology classroom with a skeleton model, bio charts, and encased spider for studying. Ooh, not a fan of that. <laughs> Upstairs, students will find a computer lab and teacher's office. Combine the set with the rest of the Playmobil school theme, um, which is like these things, or um, you can do it by itself for even more fun. This set includes three adult figures, six child figures, functioning clock with school bell, desks, backpacks, bicycles, laptops, chairs, classroom charts, books, skeleton, wheelchair, toilets, sinks, and tons of other accessories. Then we have the Playmobil Gym, which is also really cool. I wish my gym was like that when I did gym. Um, I haven't done gym. This will be my second year not doing gym. I'm so happy because in my school, we're done with gym after um, sophomore year. And I'm going to be a senior, which is crazy because a lot of you guys don't believe me. <laughs> Anyways. Play your favorite sports and get active in the gym class. Equipped with a basketball court, uneven bars, climbing ladder, and more. This gym is ready for all kinds of sports activities. No matter what sport you choose, keep track of who's winning on the, with the functioning scoreboard. Well, everything is functioning. That's so cool. Outside, a rock wall adds to the fun with the, the, when the weather is nice. There's a rock climbing wall outside? I didn't know that. <laughs> During class, students can store their gear in the cubbies, attach a set to the furnished school building for even more fun, or complete the school scene with the rest of the Playmobil school theme. This set includes adult fig one adult figure, two child figures, gym structure, basketball court, basketball net, climbing ladder, uneven bar, gymnastics, rings, uh, soccer balls, footballs, backpacks, scoreboards, duffel bags, and lots of other fun toys. Or fun accessories. And then finally, we have the Playmobil chemistry class. Oh, and that one, oh, it doesn't tell me how much that one retails for. Um, I have a little cheat sheet. It does not tell me how much that one retails for. So I'm sorry, but I can't share that with you. But then this Playmobil cl uh, chemistry class retails for $19.99. So, really awesome, okay. <laughs> and this one, experiment with solids, liquids, and gases in chemistry class. Use the Bunsen burner to examine different chemical reactions. The chart on the wall will help guide students with their experiments. Combine the set with the rest of the Playmobil school theme for even more fun. Set includes one adult figure, two child figures, lab table, desk, backpack, thermos, crystals, books, test tubes, experiment diagram, bi uh, binders, and tons of other accessories. All right, so now that we know enough about these sets, let's take them out and put them together. So the fun thing about Playmobil is that you have to build it all yourself and to me that is part of the fun. I love setting them up and like just making cute little scenes with them. Like that's one of my favorite parts. So we have to put all these together. This one has 242 pieces and these are all recommended for ages 5 and up. This one has 64 pieces and that one has 130 pieces. I'm going to film me a time lapse of me putting it all together so you guys don't have to sit here for watch me do this for like an hour, but we're about to put this whole thing together. Oh 
Okay, kind of sad that it took me like 19 minutes to figure this out. I was struggling so much trying to figure out these doors. Um, so, <laughs> yeah. Here's the school all set up, and I'll show you the front in a second. Let's just look through. So right here we have the elevator, and I put the little girl in the wheelchair here, and they have backpacks for everyone, so I slung hers like over her wheelchair. Really cute, it does roll. And then the elevator actually works. Oops, it goes up, so she can get on and off. And then when she's down here, you can open these little plastic doors so she can come in and out, and there's like ramps everywhere, so it's wheelchair accessible. There's a little bike rack here. There's only two bikes, but they just like go inside the things. And there's another bike on that side that's a little bigger. And then over here we have all the cubbies. There is the little recycling bin and some flowers. And all the cubbies open up and stuff. It's just a little hard with my nails. Um, the stairs are like kind of a spiral. We have this little girl walking up the stairs. I just kind of placed the people wherever I felt like. Here's another little girl going to the bathroom. This is the girls' bathroom and there's a boys' bathroom. They have a mirror. A toilet and a sink so they're all the same and then in here I wasn't really sure where these were supposed to go I had this kid sitting on it but he fell off um, they're just two little benches um, they could go inside or outside I just put them in this hallway this is like the main doors there is a fire alarm button and an extinguisher there's another plant and then there's like ramps on all these things and then in here is like the biology room she's this is the teacher she's teaching biology there's a skeleton back there, there's like a little bird right there, and there's a butterfly behind her. And then she has like an eyeball and stuff on her desk, and there's like posters everywhere. The tarantula in the, in the cage, it kind of scares me because there are spiders around here that look like that. And so I was really scared when it was on my rug, <laughs> so putting this together. And then I have this one little girl looking at it. And then they have little like iPads and stuff, and there's a microscope, it's so cute. And then when you go upstairs, this is like the main office, I guess, because this isn't really a classroom, but that lady, she's really cute. She has um, an actual crystal on her necklace. I That was really hard for me to put on. Um, but she has a little desk, so she's like the office, so she's got the coffee and everything. And then over here, this is another like classroom. I think this is math, because like all the computers and stuff have math on it. I tried to set it up the same as the picture, minus like the people, and then the backpacks. I don't know, I moved them around a little bit. This is the little guy, he has this pull down screen, like it moves, but I'm not going to move it because I don't want it to mess up anything. But we have his desk, and then there's some desks. This one even has a little drawing on it, and he has a little paper airplane. He seems like the little troublemaker to me, so that's why I gave him that. Yeah, and it's just really cute. The little clock works, the bell works. It's really cute. Um, and then I'll show you the front of the school now. There's little art, like graffiti on the walls, that one says kids. Um, it's really cool. You can also flip the clock so it faces out. It's kind of cool. And then the doors do open and close. They come both ways. So yeah, it's really cute. And this took me about an hour to set up. And now we have to put together the gym and the other, um, the classroom. Alright, so here's the gym all set up. This took me about 20-25 minutes to set everything up. And so this one, obviously it's smaller, so that's why it didn't take as long. It's really cool. There's a ton of things for them to do. They can climb up this little like ladder thing. Oops, I think something just fell. <laughs> um, then there's this little rope that they can climb up. I used to be so good at this when I had like when I used to do gym, I used to be so good at this. That thing back there is like a bench. I think it could also be a balance beam. I think it's both. There's like a whole bucket of balls back there. There's like a soccer ball, um, basketball, bowling ball, football. 
there and that other one I don't know what that one is <laughs> um, then these are really cool I had to like put all the string in myself this is like a hanging ladder that you climb up so I have a guy climb climbing that and these ones are like the rings so that's really cool there's a basketball hoop back there um, I'm not really sure what this is but um, I think it's like a bench I don't know or like a thing for them to step on to get up here I don't know then there's like shelves back here there's cubbies, that's what fell, the backpack fell out of the cubby. There's two backpacks for the kids. There's a gym bag on this bench. There's bowling pins and these little hoops. This little thing that this girl's like hanging on, I don't know, you can swing on those. The teacher has a whistle and he has like a little athletic outfit on. There is this scoreboard and you can actually keep score by turning the things. It doesn't like make sounds or anything, but this like turns, it's really cool. And then the outside, over here is like a little uh, plants and then the rock climbing is really cool and then there's a basketball hoop outside with this little play mat that you can like make it look like the basketball ground you could probably put it inside too if you wanted them to play basketball inside but yeah the gym is honestly really cool and you can just attach it to the um, school so well it doesn't like attach but you can put it next to the school so it looks like it's part of the school, so that's really cool. And then finally, we have to do the chemistry room. All right, and last but not least, we have this whole chemistry set. And that took about like five to seven minutes to set up. It was pretty simple because, oh, <laughs> because there's no classroom or anything. That's the only bad part about it. It doesn't have a place to be, but I'm gonna show you everything that came with it. Obviously the teacher who just fell down, he's wearing a lab coat and glasses, which is really cool. I accidentally ripped this a little bit, but I kind of got it back together, but it has a cool chemistry set going on on the chalkboard or whatever. Then we have the teacher's desk with, um, um, I think that's a water bottle. Not, we, there could be chemicals in there, we don't know. And then the little, oh yeah, on all the desks and stuff, the little drawers pull out and there's little books. A little, tear, a little chair. This little girl's also wearing a lab coat. She's holding a test tube. Over here we have this whole experimentation, or is that right? Experiment table. There's some crystals in this bowl. All these cool tubes and stuff, like that's heating it up and putting it in there. Not really sure what all this stuff is. There's a sink, um, some books, and then like science utensils. <laughs> and then over here is the student's desk. There's a backpack here, a backpack there. This student is doing something with these crystals. Um, I don't know what these are supposed to be. I think they're little droppers. And there's some test tubes in there. It's really cute. Like I said, it is kind of sad that there is nowhere for this stuff to go. I think since the biology room is pretty big, you could probably just put it all in there because there's quite a lot of room in the biology room. So yeah, but this stuff is really cool too. All right, I put it in the biology room. Now it looks really crowded because it's a ton of science stuff all in one spot. Some of it's kind of off and it looks a little weird, but if you wanted to set it up that way, you could, or you could even move all the bio stuff up here since the math stuff isn't that big. You could switch it up. Like there's no way you have to have it set up. You can really be creative with it. You could put all those stickers down here and like switch everything up to set it up how you want. I think this whole set is really cool, the whole line. And I don't know, I am just always have been such a big fan of Playmobil. And I'm pretty sure you guys know that. I just have always loved Playmobil stuff. And so getting all the new sets and like showing them to you guys is so much fun for me. Um, in total, it probably took me around like an hour and 45 minutes, like around two hours to do this whole thing. But totally worth it because like I said, I have fun building them, setting them up and like making cute little scenes. Um, I love doing that. And then now you get to like play with it and hang out with it. So I think it's a really cool set, like the whole line in all. And as sad as back to school is, this set makes it a little bit more fun. So yeah. And like you could come home after school and make your little dolls learn what you learned in school, which is also a great way to help you study. So <laughs> great tips. Anyways, thank you so, so much for my friends at Playmobil for sending me all of these awesome sets, I love them. Highly recommend you guys get them if you like Playmobil. There was a school set in the past that I had and it was just nowhere near as cool as this one and I love this one so much, like all of it. So yeah, <laughs> thank you Playmobil and thank you guys so much for watching. Please click like and subscribe and in the comments, let me know what's your favorite class in school and we'll see you guys later, bye.